Who maintains the illusion that women don't need men? Men do, out of the love for women, children, and humanity. We've seen this big push about, I don't need no man, I'm a strong, independent woman. Well, none of us are independent of each other. We are all interdependent. And as you saw before this video started, the wars that we have had throughout the centuries, the men were the ones dying and fighting to protect the women and children. Now, there are many innocent women and children that are killed as collateral damages in war, but very few women are fighting on the lines, way less than 1%. So who protects them? It's the men. Who are the ones out in the storms? as on the thumbnail, climbing the poles in the dangerous weather to maintain and keep electric going into their homes. This illusion that women don't need men has just came about more so in the Western world because men have made it so comfortable and so pleasurable. This society we have created is one of the richest, safest societies the world has ever known. But the reality is this, women need men. Women are not as strong as men. Now, does that belittle women? If it does, then you have a problem. It's not about belittling women. It's about women have their place and men have their place. If a woman says to me, you need to know your place, I would say, you're right, I do know my place. I am the provider and the protector of you and women like you. That is my job as a man to give my life to protect women and children if need be. It's a natural inherent desire or inclination if you like. And in the West, it's being belittled and called things such as toxic masculinity. But as people like me and those men who have died in wars, that they call on when the crap hits the fan. They don't complain about toxic masculinity when the criminal breaks into the house with the gun and the husband or the boyfriend has to go deal with that and protect his woman. That's the way life is. If you want to live in a delusion where you think you don't need men, then go right ahead. But the day will come when you will beg for a strong man. No different than if I said, I don't need women. My species, humanity would die out. I've had 10 kids, one was adopted. I've raised six by myself for the last 12 years. Could I have had those kids without a woman? No. Why would I delude myself into thinking that I didn't need a woman to have those kids? Sure, I raised them by myself, but did that work out as well as if I would have had a woman that helped me raise them? Of course not. Because it's obvious that a man and a woman together can raise children much better working together than a man can by himself or a woman can by herself. Why is that so hard for some people to accept that? Leave a comment in the comment section. Let me know what you think about it. Thanks for joining me. If you would like to get my help personally, marksinspiration.com is my website or marksinspirationalguidance at gmail.com. Follow me on Rumble, Instagram, and Twitter at Marks Inspiration. And have a wonderful day. Of Warsaw. The city is surrounded, but still holding out.